other than that conversation, you know, the other day where he, he told me that, that he'd probably have to fly up to Vancouver. That's that's all I know. So we haven't been in touch since, and uh, so he's I'm sure he's busy, you know, getting his life in order. He's bringing uh, uh, Jess and their boys, and it's a lot of work to move a family over, um, even if it's just for a few months. But it's you know it's, he's got a lot a lot going on. Steve, you mentioned the journey, uh, and I, I just was curious to get your thoughts on your own personal experience. Because five years, you've only been a head coach for five years, but every year you've had this team in an elite position. What, what has that been like for you? I know you'd rather talk about the team, but I mean, I'm just curious to get your thoughts about what this journey has been like for you. And well, I mean, it's it's been incredible to uh, coach this group. You know, my first coaching job to inherit this group of players. I'm, you know, I've never. Uh, Going to allow myself to take that for granted, and uh, so we're trying to um, enjoy every step of the way. Um, inevitably, you know, there there will be a, a turnover in the roster and a new era coming, whenever that is. So, try to make the most of every uh, every moment, and uh, I'm well aware of how how fortunate I am. Steve, you've been on this journey with these guys. Many of them have been with you the whole time. And as, as you said, they're, it's such an elite group. How do you find creative ways to kind of get the best out of them when they're not giving you their best at this time of the season? Uh, it's not about tricking them or anything like that. It's not about um, uh, doing anything different or fun. I mean, that is kind of part of our program as we try to keep things interesting and light and, and do some different things. But um, it doesn't matter what we do at this stage. It's uh, you know, it's it's all about um, the group understanding where we are um, and understanding the timing. And to me, it's 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 kind of time. You know, it's it's uh, it's time to start start playing and defending our home court and gearing up. Uh, we want to feel good going into the playoffs. So. Um, the, the the biggest message, the best message a coach can give a team is an honest one. So we've been pretty honest the last couple of days about our shortcomings, and uh, hopefully we're ready to roll tonight. Last one. Uh, Jordan Bell played pretty well lately and reflected on that. Um, do you think that's just uh, him getting more opportunity, or did he things out during those stretches when he was I think, I think both. I, I mean, he, you know, 